Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Steven Universe Save the Light. In the last episode we came to the Great North and made our way through here and we also made Smoky Quartz for the first time. In this episode we're just going to continue our journey. This is where we left off right or was it a little bit low? It was a little bit farther down but you know the it's the same. I think we ended like right here. So I had to walk all the way back in between episodes because for some reason I couldn't teleport to the warp pad that was right over to the left. So I had to walk all the way through the beginning of this area, but luckily I only got in two fights and neither of them got us any level ups, so I would say they're pretty inconsequential. I'm pretty sure we've also found almost all... Hold on, what is this? Are we on ice? Okay, we're on ice. It didn't look like ice. Uh, I think we've found almost all of the secrets here. I believe this downward path here is going to lead to the alternate path, or maybe it... Hold on, is that not land? That's not land, I guess. Yeah, this is the alternate path, I'm fairly certain. And we got a, ooh. So, we got a secret, secret, who's he, what's it? And this is actually that door that I was pointing out in the first area that I had to go back and show off in the forest. That's what opens that door. Okay, that's a secret. Hold on. That's not, oh. Yeah, we've already been there then. Okay. I, I was looking at it like, did we miss a secret? But no. No, no. That's the... That's the area we were at before. Is this not land? I don't think that's land. I'll do it once more. Yeah. Okay. I just... I, I don't know. It just really looked like land. Also, I'm not even going to waste time here. Might as well use a feel-good tea. Really, honestly... The damage that you take outside of battle isn't the part I'm worried about. I just really don't like how it slows down your star meter. That's the biggest downside of it. Which is good, because they needed a bigger downside than just taking a little bit of damage. Because one damage in this game is pretty much nothing. We all already have like over 100 HP. So I wouldn't worry too much about the little chip damage. But it does add up over time, so, you know... Just like any other game. But like also, since I'm so used to like Pokemon and stuff like that, where you take easily, like, what is it? One sixteenth of your HP? Okay, that missed. Okay, both of my attacks missed. All right, buddy. Okay, that's a big boy right there. That's something new. Let's see. Well, first off, Steven can knock these two into the drink pretty easily I think yeah that one's gonna be gone in the next hit unless it bounces back to the other platform he did that monster that absolute menace okay uh, the big monster on the bottom cannot be knocked back by the way which is why I'm not doing anything about that I'm gonna wait to see what all right okay uh, if I had something that had a little bit of knockback like Garnet's attack I could knock it out, but also Garnet's attack will probably knock it out outright anyway. Yeah, we'll do it. Yeah, that just knocked him out. Cool. Now we just have the big boy. This is something different. I think his attacks just chill you outright. I think it's going to attack Garnet, so I'm going to go ahead and bubble her. Just, you know, prevention. Uh, here's the thing that I could show off. We got Fireball with... Pearl, and we haven't shown it off yet, I don't think. So you basically get to aim three fireballs that each hit separate enemies, depending on where you aim. It doesn't shoot through like your spear does, but it's a lot of damage at this point in the game. You might, it might not have seemed like that. Yeah, good job, winner. Oh, he hits twice. I didn't know. I didn't know. He's going straight for another. Okay. Well, here's another thing that we can do now. We have Electrocute with Amethyst. This boy ain't gonna be able to move for a while, and she got a lucky hit with it. Every chance, every hit has a chance to lucky hit. I'm not even gonna do anything until we have the ability to like completely knock it out. So, let's see. If we use that, we're still gonna have five. I'm trying to think of what we could even do. Let's sure, okay. Let's lower its defense. It's not gonna do damage, but that's fine. It didn't do damage, so it's still electrocuted. Oh, I didn't think of that. 
All right, electrocution does wear off after a little bit. Let's just use Garnet. She's going to do the most damage. And one more hit with Pearl. It also stunned it. I forgot about that. Doink! You're done. Yeah, those monsters can be a little bit scary. Garnet got hit pretty low there. And we got two level ups out of it, too. I really need to heal Garnet here. New ability, we got Taunt. Temporary force targets the focus of their attack on Garnet instead of her allies. So it, it's a taunt, everything you would expect a taunt to be. Uh, oh, she's already healed off. Okay, that's fine. Then, oh. Everyone has level up points. Did I forget to level them up before? I'm pressing the B button. Once again, swapping from a Switch controller to this. You're never ready for it. So let's see. Is the music not playing? Huh. I don't hear the music. Let's... Encourage is increased by 20% on bubbled or protected targets. So that even in includes uh, Connie's protection ability. Let's do... Defense again. Luck. And one into attack. Might as well start doing that. I don't think I s it's saved. Because I'm pretty sure I already put those points into something before. All right, why do we why do we have four with her? Why didn't I invest that last one? Okay, that's fine. Well, boost that attack. Now it's gonna cost three. And uh, let's get her some teamwork. Another one unlock, which is basically yes, I did earn this. It's essentially an attack upgrade. Yeah, nothing too complicated there for me. No complicated choices. Hello. All right, now we have you. I'm going to put a bunch into defense now that you have taunt. She can be a much more defensive character. A much more tanky character, I'll say. Hello? Another level up charm. If you're wondering, I am saving that for when we're like higher up in levels and leveling up takes longer and is worth more. Well, it's not really worth more, is it? Because... We're just getting started. Yeah, because we're just getting started. It's not really worth more because skills later on take more star points to invest, so. Here we are. You know how it is. Now she's frozen. Okay, she wasn't frozen in that last scene. Was it because I went into my inventory or something? Hello, fire salt. Gladly take that. Oh, we have new enemies here. Oh boy. And it feel good. Yeah, feel good, T. That enemy up there is something different. A little bit scary. I see that secret on the left. You can't hide it from me. I'm not even sure if I ever got this on my original playthrough. Oh, it's another warp. Well, I'm pretty sure I did then. Plus a big ice cube. Very big and very cold ice cube. Might as well hang on to it. You can imagine what that's for. So now... Hmm. Nope, I don't want to warp. No, no, no. Let's swap around a little bit, I think. Let's drop Garnet for... Ugh, Greg really hasn't gotten much, much time in the spotlight, has it? You know what? Let's grab Greg. Why not? Let's get some Greg action on in here. We're going to keep Amethyst and Pearl just because they have their, uh, they have their team up charged and there's no reason to waste that. Oh, come on. She was in the middle of a jump. I'm going to hit this from far away because it's dangerous not to. So this wizard enemy is pretty much the Greg of enemy teams. This one's just a trick. I'm going to have him speed up our star thing since Pearl is frozen. And I'm also actually just going to go ahead and heal her off. Wow, I scrolled all the way through that. Nope! I don't know if that's going to hit Greg. Here, just in case. So now that won't hit him, and we can interrupt this attack. Once again, works just like Greg. Alright. Also, why is our thing still frozen? That's kind of worrisome. You know what? Let's do it.
Here we go. So this is Opal. Uh, she has the Reign of Arrows, which is a super powerful attack and supercharged shot. A supercharged, powerful aimed shot that deals high damage, breaks shields, and lowers defense. However, the Reign of Arrows is what I want. It's going to hit all enemies in a little area for a good while. So it'll just keep hitting them. In fact, that might have been all we needed to do at this point. Look at this. They're almost dead. That's almost it. Nope. You're done. Let's see. <laughs> Sorry, bud. Sorry about it. Delicious. That is ridiculous damage. Are the arrows still coming down? Uh, you should be just about dead. E just let it go. He's going to get hit out of it anyway. But yeah, I would say Opal's probably one of the most... Oh, there she goes. Opal's probably one of the most powerful of the, of the fusions. Because, oh, that Reign of Arrows attack is just so incredibly powerful. But then again, at the same time, I am building... That's a lot of talking. I am building Pearl as an, like, straight-up attack character. So that could have a very, very heavy influence on how powerful Opal was there. But yeah, I would recommend her very much. Get Steven to get this. Oop, another Boltron token. Very nice. There it is again! Mysterious spaceship is mysterious. That's... That's a lol cat from, like, 2009. No time to waste. They... Is, is that supposed to be a reference to lol cats? Oh, I don't even know how many people watching this is even gonna know what a lol cat is. Hello there. Boom. Whoa, I can't even roll into it? When it's rolling, when it's on its way? Yeesh, I see that boy back there. Why do we have that? How about this tasty number? Our star counter is still frozen. That's so weird. All right, I don't care what happens here as long as it doesn't hit Greg, to be honest. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so what are we going to do here? Uh, we could just use the fireballs. Doink. Doink, and that's... Burnt. Oh, I tried to hit the other one. That's right, I forgot. Pearl's uh, lucky attacks inflict burn now. So she'll be able to whenever she gets a lucky... Which is another reason why we should start getting more lucky hits with her. In fact, if we ever do get a badge that allows us to... Uh, to increase her lucky hit rate... I think I'd go for it. We're not doing much damage with this, are we? Who's it going for? Probably Pearl? Really? Really? Okay, that's fine. Uh, give it with Steven. We haven't even seen their power-up thing yet. Let's get to the next tier. And start going ham. Whoa! It's not aiming right. Oh, that sucked. That, I, I promise. I promise that it was just not working and I'm not just insane. Also, we got a freebie, so... Yeah, that's weird. I have to, like, wiggle it around first before it'll aim properly. Okay. Well, that's a little worrisome. Also, I think we got a, a, a level up with Amethyst that I didn't invest, actually. We do. All right. So, what's going on here? We got a lot of luck. Let's just put into teamwork. Uh, Steven form ability gets applied to the entire team. Yeah, sure. Go. Oh, that costs three, not two. I'm silly. Uh, defense. All day, every day. Now, Mr. Greg. Greg was a little bit behind in levels, so he has a lot of points to invest here. Um, his healing jam can get lucky heals. He is very much of a support character. The one thing that's weird is that the fact that he uh, he acts as a support character, yet the fact that you can't get rid of Steven on your team kind of makes it required for him to be a second support character if you're going to run him. Which, sure, if you're looking for longevity, you're going to be you're gonna be fine there, that's for sure. But, man, sometimes it's just like you really don't want to support characters. It's very a very slow and gradual way to play the game. Hello there. Speaking of getting a lucky badge, 
Thank you very much. That is actually going to go... Whoops. Nope. Wrong buttons. That's actually going to go right on to Pearl. Here we go. Well, if it helps me in battle. Freebie badge is really good. I'm going to go ahead and hop that on to Amethyst. Ooh, She's... I, I don't think she needs the experience up. In fact, you know what? Greg could use the experience up now. Because he's the only one that's kind of falling behind. Because we didn't use him much. Hello there. Got him. Oh, we have... Oh, gosh. that's. I thought we had a new enemy. It looked like wings when it was loading in. All right. But we still have that frozen effect. That's really bothering me. Maybe it's not actually like that. All right, you're going for Steven. That's fine. Let's see. Oh, we have a we have a coach, Steven. Steven super encourages Pearl, granting her a big attack and defense bonus. You know what? Let's do it. You're strong in the real way, Pearl. It's gonna make her super powerful. Oh, and a luck bonus too. I didn't even know that. So let's go ahead and pop a star fruit so she can get popping. And completely annihilate this enemy from the behind. Disgusting. Is that enemy not looking at Steven? Hold on. I don't I don't want Steven to get attacked here. There we go. That was more like it. That was big damage. She's not going to be able to hit these other ones from the back though. Look at look at Greg's arm. He's going nuts. All right, well, she's about to get attacked, so I'm just going to go ahead and uh, protect her. And I'm going to wait for the star meter to fill. Oh, come on. You're going for Greg. I'm going to go ahead and wait for the star meter to fill back up. Oh, no, he's not. He's going for Steven, so we can use fireballs. However, this one's turned away, so I think we'll be able to do more damage this way. Doink. Well, it's not anymore. Yeah, it is. Okay. And we burned it, which is good. Burn does a lot of damage, by the way. I'm not sure if we ever got a proper time to see what it does, but it does three damage like every half second or so. Very powerful. In fact, I think he's not going to live until he gets to me. Gets to Steven. Boom. Gone. That easy. All right. You're still going for Pearl. Um, yeah. Go for it. Do your worst. Oops. Wow. That wasn't too good, was it? Oh, no. Uh, we're going to heal you a little bit. Me thinks. I got a lucky heal. Making good use out of those level ups. All right, who are you going for now? Steven again? Jeez. Well, guess what? The dude turned his back again. So now we go to town. One, The one thing I have a problem with in terms of fireballs it kind of ignores defense a little bit but other than that you're way better off just using three attacks on enemies especially if they have their back turned against you you're gonna do so much more damage that way he's not even gonna get to us okay one more attack will knock it out so I'm gonna go ahead and drop a heal onto uh, onto you, Pearl Steven. so that she can get the final blow Boom! She gets so many lucky attacks. Wow, that's nuts. That lucky badge really is coming through clutch. I really do like Pearl as a character in this game. Gotta say. And we don't even have some of her best abilities yet. That's the thing. Okay. You know, we're really not doing any attacks with Steven. Healing effect of Steven's encourage is increased by 20% on bubbles. Ukulele now gives the target a small regeneration. Okay. I feel like teamwork might be the first one to, uh, to bump up for Steven. Just because, like, he's always going to be working with other characters and some of his most useful attacks, or some of his most useful skills straight up just comes from... No. Just comes from his team-up attacks. So I'm gonna leave that. I'm probably just going to put full in on teamwork on him from now on. Uh, we really don't need the attack increase. Because, like, 
a lot of his team up attacks is just, hey, boost this other character's stats. Same with Greg, of course. Oh, here we go. Here we go. You know what? Before we get into this fight, hopefully this fixes the bug. And actually gets rid of uh, the iced thing. Can I get to him? I can! Perfect. Well, for obvious reasons, this is going to be kind of a simple fight here for the beginning. Doink! Okay, unless I miss my it my timings. Jeez. No, we're knocking you right off. We're not dealing with that. Sorry about it. The other guy has a shield, so that's going to be a little tougher. The moment he drops it, though, you're done. I know that guy's walking up to someone and someone's about to get big destroyed, but I'm fine with that. For now. We almost have our next five anyway. All right, you are going to stop right there. I'm not letting that happen. Sorry about it. Uh, if we played a healing song, I believe that just builds Greg's friendship with everyone. So let's go ahead and start doing that. Yeah, even if they're full, I think they start getting it. We're just going to let it play out a little bit just so we can build this up a little bit. This is this is the fun kind of stuff you can do in this game. Just completely cheese it. And you can just do this over and over again. This is also a very good way to build up heals if you're really low on heals and you have no... Oh, it's not healing them anymore. Okay. Well, here. Let's make Pearl a force to be reckoned with, why don't we? All right. Uh, hmm. I'm just going to keep him stunned. No reason not to. Get this next upgrade. Also, you can change your song now if you want to. The, oh, I didn't mention that. I've never mentioned that. You can just change songs without a penalty to, uh, to your star points at all. So definitely do that when you can. And I'm just going to go ahead and finish this guy off. Doink. Look at that. No attack invested. Yet we can still knock out that big enemy with Steven. Simple as that. Easy stuff. Alrighty, we got another level up. Oh, hello, everyone. Yeah, hello. So, man. When Pearl delivers a perfect attack against an enemy, any hollow Pearls attacking that same target will deliver a, a bonus attack simultaneously. That's powerful. Man, I really do just want to go all in on attack with Pearl. I don't care. I really don't. She's already overpowered. Let's just make her more so. I could almost make that. Okay, nothing at the end of this. This is where a bunch of secrets are going to be, so I'm going to have to keep my eye out. Pearl, get up here. This is a job for you. We've got a lot of blue chroma. I'm not even sure if we really need this much throughout the game, to be honest. There's got to be something hidden here. Okay, those are little star bits. Hello, enemy. I knew it was... Hello? He just flew off into the... Okay. Oh, already, huh? Okay. Uh, whoa. Overheals the entire team to 125 health. What is this? Team Fortress 2? Okay. I could do the... He, he has not been near any enemies lately. That's kind of frustrating. How little we're getting out of that. Start playing, buddy. Spikes, okay. That's fine. We're gonna protect our dad. Now we go nuts. Um, here. You're not gonna get that spike attack off, I'm afraid. Sorry to say it. Oh, he's going... Okay, he's not going for Amethyst. That would've canceled the attack. I'm getting really bad at my... My action commands lately. Oh, here comes big boy. He's moving. And he's gone. He's gonna die from the burn. I missed the other enemy. That's on me. Steven, huh? The only person that hasn't attacked yet. Uh, we'll give it from Pearl. We haven't seen that team up. Yo, yeah, we did. We just saw them use the coaching. Oop, Amethyst has a freebie. So, no reason not to. 
Might as well. This is gonna be hard to see. That'll do it. Boom! They're both burnt. They're both going to be knocked out by it eventually. Yeah. Give some amethyst love. There that one goes. Oh, he's shooting. And it only hit Steven. I still have no idea where like the the range of attack of that is. That is such an odd attack. Alright, let's go ahead and grab the rest of the I keep wanting to call these star bits. I don't know why. I'm not even sure if I really know their official name. Is that a white star fruit? Sure is. I'm going to, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and end it off there. We're almost at the end of the area, but we'll finish it off later. See you all then, and goodbye.